We have made two requests as uh, the leadership of Azimio here led by His Excellency Kalonzo Musioka. Number one, we are aware that there are still a number of Kenyans, very many Kenyans who are still missing. When we have asked the DCI uh, officers here, they have told us that it is not them who took these uh, uh, people. So despite the promises that were made by Ruto during the campaign, he is still maintaining police hit squads, people who are not even known to the police. And they are the ones conducting these abductions. At least for Alfred Keter, there were people there to film it. And that is why he is still safe here. As a father, I would never wish what happened to Alfred Keter to happen to any one of us who have children. That I'm taken away kicking and screaming in front of my own kids. Those kids are traumatized for life because nobody wants to see that happening to their parent. The second request we have made to the DCI is that if there is any leader in Azimio, any one of us, who they need to see or talk to or to speak to or to, if you have any issue with any one of us, we are available at very short notice. You, there is no need to go and break down on Babu or Wino's uh, door at home when his uh, wife and children are there. If you want us, let us know. And we have given our numbers here. They have Sifuna's number, they have Honorable Kalonzo's number, they have Eugene's number, they have all of our numbers. If they need us, we will come the way that we have brought ourselves on time, any single time they want us, because we are not criminals and we will not accept to be treated as criminals. I thank you.